What's up, poppin' Pisces? I'm Laurel, and welcome to Love Pisces in this mother sucker, baby. Join me as I read you, you all's lives. Thank you to everyone who has liked, shared, commented, subscribed to my channel. Baby, you already know I appreciate each and every single one of you Pisceans. Yes, I do. And if you need to get a personal reading from me, make sure that your ass hit that description box down below and check out my website, laurelsmoon.com for any other magical purposes and deviation workings and things of that nature. So Pisces, you already know I love you, baby. And once we get in this car hot box, Y'all already know what time it is, okay? So, while you guys are here, go ahead and put chocolate on in the algorithms. Make sure that you guys hit that like, share, and subscribe button for your girl. Go ahead and hit that notification bell button as well, too. Let me bring your motherfucking bell, okay? When the bitch got, when the bitch got, uh, 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 uh messages and things, okay? So, <laughs> Pisces, hopefully it doesn't get too dark. I will be doing the singles reading in the dog, honey. No, I'm just kidding. But um, let me go ahead and get my disclaimers out there. All right, here, right now. Yes, honey, this video is sponsored by King Psychics. I want you all to hit that description box so you can get your first 10 minutes for under $1.99 under Love Pisces link code. Now, with that being said, I might be talking about your future partner, your person, your shoulda, woulda, couldas, have nots, maybes, possiblys, won't not, should nots. Nigga get tired of doing this intro, but I got to say it to the motherfuckers in the back, okay? If your ass don't understand what's going on, what's being said, I will be probably doing a video of what all my little sayings are probably here pretty soon, because it seemed to me like, it seemed to me like some people ain't really, you know, getting it. So... With that being said, let me scoop my motherfucking seat up and turn these heat warmers on so they can warm my cheeks. Now, y'all better be lighting up, smoking up, toking up and drinking up and kicking your Pisces motherfucking feet up, baby, because we about to see what's going down now. If it start getting too dark and shit, I'm going to have to end the reading. I might have to do another singles read because like I be telling y'all, I am a negative nine. I wear the biggest of the biggest of glasses because your girl is literally blind. Okay, that's probably why I can read now. But anyway, with that being said, Pisces, you already know what it is and what it ain't. This is going to be for my single. So this is going to also be for my sun, moon, rising, Venus penis north node and also for my south node and for my mouth i feel like i'm doing are you afraid of the dog <laughs> so pisces let's see what's going down spirit you are welcome into this piscean reading You must sage the cards for all of my Piscean gods. All right, so um, Claire audience messages. I was getting Return of the Motherfucking Mac. <laughs> I don't know where that song is coming from, but some of y'all might be coming out of your little single hide, or whatever the fuck the case may be. Some of y'all just want to get out there, get in the playing field, okay, see what's going on, the little drunk Christmas parties and the uh, 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 holiday parties and shit or whatever the fuck. And that was the feeling that I was getting was Return of the Mac. So, y'all let me know what that's significant, if that song is significant to you. Morris, Mark, was it Mark Morrison, I think, sang that song. Um, let me go ahead and get my cards out. I did bring my villain cards this time, Pisces. Now, your girl is smoking some motherfucking dank in this motherfucker. So, if I start coughing and choking and shit, bitch, like I'll be telling y'all, you ain't smoking if your ass ain't choking. Okay, so, with that being said, let me shuffle these hoes for all of my single Pisces. One more time. I was also getting um, 
for some of you all, um, it, uh, what the fuck? It was, it just came to me and then it just left. It'll come back to me. It'll come back to me. It'll come back to me. Um, now I want you all to check out my store. Uh, make sure you all get your protection with your chicken feet. Okay. Now I was getting return of the Mac. And I was also getting, um, now some of y'all might be trying to get some, some options, some variety popping. Okay. Um, but I also feel like you're not trying to give away all of your heart. You might just be, you know, wanting small little friendships, see what, see where they will last. Now I was going to talk about seasonal shit. Okay. Uh, for some of you single pies, before I get into the reading, cause I am going to be shuffling the cards a little bit more. But for some of you single Pisces, you might be, um, I feel like you all are happy in your spaces alone, okay? But at the same time, there are some Pisces that are out there that want um, new friendships, new discovery. Um, also, you know, going through discovery of self or oneself. Um, it's going to be very vital for a lot of you all. But I was the 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 vibe that I was getting was... Bitch, I'm grown. That's the vibe I was getting. Um, it's just a, a feeling of, you know, having zero regrets. Um, zero tolerance. You know what I mean? Um, because I did get in the other, I did get in the other reading that some of you guys are going to be auntie and uncle motherfucking Ursula and uncle Javar and shit like that. Um, that's the reason why I brought these cards. I, I knew I was going to use these cards for a reason, but, um, I was getting, you know, some of y'all just need to take some of these situations to the motherfucking altar, period. Some of y'all just need to take it to Jesus. Okay, take it to New Bethlehem or whatever the fuck y'all, whatever y'all believe in out there, shit. Fucking India or whatever it is y'all believe in, shit. You know what I mean? Deities, gods, whatever. Some of y'all just need to take some of the old bullshit to the motherfucking altar and drop that motherfucker off right there and tell the ancestors thank you for the lesson and keep the motherfucking pushing. I'm also getting some of you guys are like seeing so many things in the world that you're just turned the fuck off or you feel like you just consistently attract certain types and certain behaviors and shit like that and you know just that one minute of uh tongue licking and shit you could turn your life upside the fuck down so that's what i was getting return of the back return of the mac <laughs> ah, so I feel like some of y'all, you know, you might be putting on your Sunday's motherfucking best getting dressed on these hoes and telling them what it is and what it ain't and somebody's liking that shit at a distance. But they're too afraid to tell you because I feel like some of you guys are in powers of positions or there's certain positions of power that you might be in that this person might be intimidated or they just need to step their motherfucking game up like I always be saying. So give it to me for my single Pisces. Okay, we got the moon here. I forgot what that lady's name, but this was Eartha Kitt's uh, role on The Emperor's New Groove. Okay, so some of you guys are seducers. You're like, yes, yes, Marcus, yes, Marcus. She said, Marcus, I'm not wearing any pansies. <laughs> So, yes, I feel like some of y'all feel like you're about to be a cool girl, an old freak, okay? Uh, <clears throat> I feel like some of y'all might uh, feel as though you got to pay for the pussy or you got to pay for the dick or something like that. <laughs> this could be sugar mama status, sugar daddy status, you know, shit like that. You know what I mean? I'm getting that some of you guys uh, enjoy your time of wisdom and uh, your time of peace, you know, because the hermit does not like to be fucking disturbed. And we have the hermit energy here. 
So I feel like somebody is uh, trying not to disturb the peace or someone could, uh, you know, feel as though they just don't want to be interrupted. Shit, point blank and motherfucking period. Now, you also have the Seven of Wands, which is Maleficent. So this is somebody, if they have something directed towards them, okay, more than likely they are trying to follow a path or there just could be a lot of envy, a lot of things that you're seeing through people that you need to see. Okay, so that's why I don't be getting mad at certain life lessons because it's what you needed to see, what you needed to learn to know if that next motherfucker to spot that next shit out, okay? Or to uh, call out ugly behaviors and emotions that people try to manipulate. You know, I have to tell that every single day to children. Like crying ain't gonna get you nowhere, baby. So don't you cry with me. You got to communicate, you got to speak up. Okay, it's okay to cry because mommy does that shit every motherfucking morning with my blunts. Okay. <laughs> it's okay to cry, but you do need to be able to support what the tears are for. And, you know, when you have so many people that are envious of you, when there are people who don't know how to love and mind their business or keep to themselves until they work on their motherfucking self. And it's like, bitch, I don't want you. Straight up. And I feel like that's why these cards are coming out. Some of you guys might be coming off as uh, just uh, like, un I I'm getting kind of like undetectable, but at the same time, like you're there in a flash and then you're in and you're out. That's that mutable energy, you know? Um, but with the seven of wands here, it does signify to me that there's something directed towards you all right but at the same time people don't know whether or not to be accepting or if they're good enough and that'd be the realest shit ever some people the levels be different you meet them at different times different paths different frequencies and it don't be the right time sometimes it'd be perfect timing just the right time sometimes it, it's unnecessary and you feel like you're wasting time and I feel like a lot of you guys are trying to avoid anything that causes unnecessary uh, problems aimed your direction okay now we also have judgment energy here so for some of you singles you might feel like bitch I'm cool on you I'm cool on him them okay being very critical and analytical towards what is around you and I completely understand baby yes I do okay so putting forth that judgment that understanding and telling motherfuckers what it is and what it ain't all right also using your moral compass and your guides to help you get to where you're you're wanting to understand certain things where it's not just an alarming situation or motherfuckers throwing up red flags and shit you know Ace of Cups here. So, some of you Pisces have new love coming in, okay? Or you already have love, or you know the worth of self-love and self-care. Um, now, this could be a new spirit, a new energy, or a new offer that could be coming towards you. I think I got this shit two weeks ago. And like, I be telling y'all, I be like, bitch, Where? said yeah well, i'll be checking my imaginary watch too where how okay should i be looking like oh okay so let's get a signifier of where this is or some sort of indicator of new love because i'll be like okay well you saying new love coming through or whatever you know or shit where bitch because all i do is go to motherfucking stores stay at the house i do my job okay and exercise my motherfucking right to be a decent citizen in this motherfucking world okay so let's see give me a signifier what is this person going to be um wearing or holding or looking like for my single pisces with this ex of cups very first card out is the will of fortune okay so this could be by um i'm also i'm getting um i'm getting the circuits i'm also getting bare grounds or something like that and i'm also getting sewing machines or sewing um this could be like you know mardell's this could be uh 
Joann's, uh, what's that one store called? Michael's that I go to all the goddamn time. I'm also getting with the Wheel of Fortune here. This could be at a gambling place or this could be where someone is gambling of some sort. You have the Five of Cups here, all right? So this definitely could be by a bar or someone that where it, it could be a lot of water. Um, it also could be a lot of cups or drinks, things of that nature. This person might be involved with drinks or they might deliver drinks or something like that. I don't know if they're the motherfucking milkman or some shit. <laughs> but I'm seeing drinks. It could be a loss or it just has, it's a scattered energy. You know what I mean? Now you do have the chariot energy and right behind that is the six of swords. So this could be somebody that's driving, but you got Cruella DeVille on this card and she looked like she's straight manicure. Okay, so this could be a driver. Somebody's driver here. It could be a possible Cancetian. Another Pisces or a Scorpio here. All right, that's if you want it, baby. But I'm seeing something about a drinking fountain with all of these cups. Yeah, this looks like um, somebody that you have to imagine, okay? Someone who's faceless or their back is turned. Let's see what else we got. We have the death energy, so possible Scorpio. Oh, shit. Don't be getting mad at me in the comments now. Shit. Also, Knight of Wands, so Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. This might be all goofy-ass motherfuckers. Somebody want to laugh with you, sniggle and giggle and shit. But it looks to me like they are, I don't know, they look kind of corny and shit. Or this person looks overbearing with this death energy here. Smother you to death, okay? Shit, thinking that they love you and shit, but they on the outside doing some fuck-ass shit. Right, but you do have the strength energy, so possible Leo, also Scorpio, and I'm also getting um, Cancer Pisces, Cancer or Pisces. Three of Cups here, I'm getting a lot of Cups, and King of Cups, so King of Wands, King of Cups, also you got Javar. And the Knight of Cups. So someone's going to try to take some action towards you. Or they are, like I said, they are afraid to take action. Because you do have the High Priestess at the bottom of the deck. <laughs> so. Somebody's mad because you know everything. People get mad at that. They try to use that or abuse that shit. But I do see um, something with wood as well, too, that you might meet this person. Okay, and I'm also getting telescopes or something with the night sky and nighttime. So let's get my cutthroat cards in this marasaka. Give it to me for my Pisces, my single Pisces. You got love. Very first card out. And gotcha, bitch. <laughs> Night Rider. Yeah, somebody's going to sneak up at nighttime. Also could be dealing with a car or something like that. I just return to the Mac. And cut throat. Why well, you already know we gotta be uh, talking shit to people and people ain't no good for you and shit. And you don't wanna talk to them so you ain't giving no time of day. You ain't even worried about nobody. Yeah. Stay in your own motherfucking lane. I understand, baby. Yes, I do. 
But love is here. You definitely might meet this person at night. Mm-hmm. Night Rider. All right, here we go. We got fetish. Uh-oh. So somebody might be watching your fetish. They might like sucking toes. They may like, uh, 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 uh. They may like, uh. Damn, I can't even think of some shit. My mind don't even go there no more. Damn. Okay. Coochie, is you okay? You breathing still? <laughs> so, Pisces, yeah. I mean, you know, a fetish could be anything. Sucking toes, okay? A fetish could be uh, breast play, whatever the case may be. Okay, my motherfucker might like anal. They might like, you know, uh, booty her, shave her. Shit, I don't know what the fuck people be liking out there. Okay, but somebody definitely has a fetish that they trying to fulfill or something, honey. Okay, now you got sheep. And in reality, also foreign here. and energy so somebody's waiting Miss Dingleberry okay now some of y'all could have been cold as motherfucking ice or cold as ice but somebody is waiting scoping right now scoping the scene um like I said this person might be hesitant but they remember something or they capture something what they remember honey I'm also seeing for some of you all leveling the fuck on up baby okay you gotta level up so, this is a new level, okay? Hopefully, there ain't no new devils. Hopefully, we can change that uh, paraphrase because I don't like that shit. But, yeah, we got knock knock. So, something's coming for sure. Now, we're going to take a look at um, my fellas. And then, we're going to take a look at my ladies. And then I'm going to get on out of here. So all together, I'm seeing love, baby. I'm going to get these. Um, I'm going to get these period cards. Here we go. Give it to me for my Pisces. My fellas. My males. My divine masculine. Here we go. We got, I'm trying to see something, what you try to see. Somebody, somebody trying to get that old thing back, baby. Okay, somebody trying to see something, okay. They want to see a picture of something, so don't be scared, fellas. They be like, shit, bitch, you want to see the dick pic or not? Nah, are we going out on a date, okay? Are we going to be talking about Elon Musk, or is you trying to do this sloppy toppy? What we doing, okay? Now, we got... Uh, <laughs> I ain't mad at nobody, baby. So I feel like um, there's, for some of you all, someone could be mad at you and they're pretending like they're not mad or some of y'all just like, shit, I'm just cool with it. Okay, and then you got mad, mad. Yeah, I know it. So somebody's definitely mad at my single fellas. Okay. And then we got, yes, bitch, yes. So somebody like it, but they mad. And we got to stop, stop doing shit you don't want to do people pleasing so yeah don't be doing shit for the extra motherfuckers okay bitch i told you straight like that now if somebody got a hold on you because i do have thief it says fuck the type of shit you on thief so somebody feels like either you stole something from them or y'all was on some max shit some player shit okay or this person could be a little thief straight up so let's see for my ladies Give it to me for my ladies, for all of my Pisces. Damn, I can barely see. Here we go. All right, badass kids. And who the fuck is this? So, yeah. So, some of y'all might be dealing with somebody you question, could be questionable. Right? You might be like, who the fuck is you? Ew. What? I can't hear ugly talk. Uh-uh. 
<laughs> okay. So, we also have <laughs> tired of being strong. Who gonna be there for me? Anybody got your back? So, I feel some of y'all might need some help or you just tired of doing the manly things and whatnot. Okay, but it's also, uh, you got... Damn, I should have listened to my mama lesson. So some of y'all already know you might have to self-sabotage some shit. I know there's some bullshit, but damn it, I love it. Even if it's some good dick or some good pussy or whatever the fuck y'all do out there, it's saying for some of y'all ladies that some of these people might think y'all crazy or something or you are just very spunky, okay? Or you got a lot of um, <clears throat> personality characteristics. Now, some of these motherfuckers can't handle multiple things. They're not multifunctional, all right? You got to understand and discover. And it's okay that some people are not multifunctional. But for some of you ladies out there, somebody is, uh, you know, trying to figure out. Um, to me, I feel like um, they want to be proud of you or somebody's trying to, like, congratulate you or something like that. It says, hold the fuck up, patience, slow down think things through and I'm proud of you boo win so y'all just keep on going is all I'm gonna say whether or not it's uh, you know other people to love out there or to just continue loving yourself straight like that I'm an advocate for that shit can't nobody tell me otherwise. I'm going to go get my facial treatments and my motherfucking massage therapy. And I'm going to go get my motherfucking um, makeups. Okay. Shit. And I'm going to make sure that I have got my investments in control and that I have the right things on top of shit. And then the rest of that shit just fall down the motherfucking line. Okay. But ain't nobody got time for no liars. Uh, no people who, people who have to, you got to keep on addressing shit all right but i do feel like somebody's coming at nighttime or something is coming at night or something somebody gonna scoop you off your feet at nighttime baby okay so oh and i was about to say um you know some people be like oh i found somebody blah 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 like a month ago i'd be like bitch you must have been listening to the singles read because you know love was coming and shit you know what i mean so it's like i don't want to listen to tarot anymore it's like okay Shit, well, you was one of the chosen. You know what I mean? So, shit. Everybody got a choice. Everybody got choices. Okay? It's up to you if you want to be a Mac, a Mac daddy, a Mac mama. Shit. It's up to you, baby. All right, baby. I'm going to get on out of here. I love you guys all so much. Let me know what you all think in the comments down below. Somebody want to love you, baby. Return of the Mac. Or somebody feel like you a Mac or something. Okay. But yeah. All right, Pisces. I love you guys all so much. Let me know what you all think in the comments down below. And I'll see you guys in the next video.